Uh, today's session is on uh, botanical lettering, and uh, your mentor today is going to be uh, Art with Smita. Hello. Yeah. So, are we ready to do this today? Don't they look beautiful? A lot of flowers. Every time you want to give a card to your friend or make a poster, you can use this. What calligraphy or lettering it is. Calligraphy is not all about just using the calligraphy pen. If you are in a situation where you need to write something beautifully, it is calligraphy and you can use anything, a stick, a nib, a pencil, a sketch pen, whatever is available around you. If you see what I have made as a sample, all my alphabets are of the same size. So first, we will need a ruler today. We will need a black gel pen, pencil, and some pencil colors. Yes, that's good. So let's take our paper. I have taken my ruler, the width of my ruler, as the measuring point. So it is approximately a, a, an inch broad. So I will draw lines which are suggestion lines for the size of my alphabets. So all through my paper, I'm drawing these lines. One inch, then a half inch gap. Oh, I take my black pen, gel pen or ballpoint pen, letter A, slanting line, a small sleeping line, a big sleeping line, a broken slanting line, a small sleeping line. Now, this is my flower. A tulip. I give some leaves. And to add some intricacy, I'm giving small little circles. I color my flower red with my pencil color. The leaves, of course, green. The dots purple. Okay, I'm starting alphabet B, a straight line with a flower on top, 
a straight line with a flower on top, like a lollipop. It's a six petal flower. Now, for my B, I take a broken line like this. And then, this is a double flower drawing. Here I make a tulip. I do leaves, not many leaves, just five or six leaves. One, two, three, four, and five. Five leaves, same dots. Just two or three dots, not many. Now with my pencil color, I'm going to color the flower red, one flower red, one flower purple, you can do the colors of your choice. Green leaves, and I'm doing orange dots. So now you'll have got an idea of how the coloring is going to be. Now, what we are going to do, we are going to write three alphabets and then color the three so that uh, it's more interesting. Now we go to C. An arc or semicircle on the top and a semicircle at the bottom. We do a tulip in between. And we do one, two, three, four, five leaves, and one on the top, six leaves. And one, two, three, four circles. Next alphabet, D. Broken line for the D, a six petal flower in between, one, two, three, four, four leaves. Putting the E, a small standing line. Broken and another, a sleeping line, and up, small up, straight line, sleeping line, the middle line of the E, a tulip here, one, two, three leaves. One circle, two circle, and three. F is almost similar, so we do the F and then color all the four alphabets. For a little variety, I give a six petal flower here. Similar to E. One petal leaf, two and three. One circle, two, three. And I'm going to color all of them, and you can also color in white.
first color all the flowers. Then color all the leaves. Then I take purple color and make the dots. Again, we are going to do four of the alphabets and then continue. G is very similar to C. This is my G. They do a tulip here. And then do the leaves. One. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five dots. H is a little greedy. It wants two flowers. So we are going to make two flowers in H. One flower, slant, another flower. Line on top, sleeping line. Line below, sleeping line. So it has both variety of flowers. Leaves one, two, three, four, five, and six. One circle, two, three. A sleeping line, standing line, gap, yeah. sleeping line. I with the tulip. One, two, three, four leaves and two circles. That's my eye. Now we are going to J, a sleeping line. Straight line, gap, up, small sleeping line here. Any of the flowers are either a tulip or your five petal. I've done a tulip. One, two, three, four. Five leaves. One, two, three, four dots. Are we ready to color? We finished four line, four alphabets. Yes, let's start. I'm coloring my flowers. I'm coloring my leaves.
we are starting with alphabet A. A straight line, small sleeping line, a small sleeping line on the top, a little curve line, followed by a flower. And we do leaves now. Four leaves, that's alphabet K, alphabet L. A tulip at the center. And leaves here. Three leaves. And three circles. I start with M. See the way how I'm writing the M. That's my alphabet M with the tulip in the center. Two leaves here. Other side, I'm doing only leaves. Dots. That's my M. We'll finish till Z, then we will do all the coloring. One, two, three, four, five dots. O, that's my O with the tulip here. Leaves. I'm going to P Q is very similar to O. I go to R. I go to my S. Leaves. And my circles. I'm going to T.
a six petal flower right in the middle. You we the blue. X. Y. Then go to my last alphabet. That's it. Amazing, very nice, beautiful. All right, have a nice day. Take care. Bye, everyone.